What is up everyone, Predator301 here, and today I got a pretty good tip for you. Now today I'm going to be showing you the best tactical grenade in Black Ops 2, and it is the EMP grenade. Now the reason it's the best, and the black hat, as T. Martin says, is the best, it's actually not. Now here I'll show you why, and I'll explain at the end why it's not better than the black hat. So let's get started. So the class setup that I'm using right now is the vector with three attachments and the danger close proficiency show proficiency so I can show you guys the better how it works on equipment so as you can see here I take out my vector and I'm gonna show you how like how it affects and you'll see quickly that it affects you even when you're behind walls like it's not like a flash where you have to be visible to it it's just got a radius and it goes through walls right it's like ra radiation so as I throw it upstairs it even affects you downstairs now I did jump now you don't have to jump because it's like I guess it's like a 30 meter sphere right like a sphere radius and right here I'm gonna go try and show you that it even works on equipment now I did use my own equipment because I didn't have anybody else because I don't have internet currently but it even shows you now when it blows up the equipment it doesn't sh actually blow up as I'll demonstrate later but look at this I put the C4 in the house I throw the thing outside and the C4 blows up inside which is pretty amazing simply because th at that point you don't even have to like think about it twice and the perk is that you don't have to use engineer to know if it's there right so you just throw that in in the house and it's clear pretty much which is kind of cool and here's showing you that it sh it works even between levels by throwing the c4 up top and then i'm going to throw the um emp grenade down low and it blows it up which is kind of cool and uh right here i sh you can even stun people with it right like it um, here, here I show you that it doesn't blow any. I was expecting the car to blow, but it doesn't. And what I was trying to show you earlier was that you can, when you stun people, you get 50 XP when you stun them. But you have to stay alive. You can't shoot them a little bit and then, like, I mean, EMP them and then, uh, uh, what's it called? Uh, and then kill them the next life. So here I show you that it works through a roof. And then right here, I show you how far it works. And it actually works pretty far. Look how far it went. And it killed it, which is pretty amazing at that distance. And uh, soon enough, I'll do another test right after I kill myself here. So uh, the reason this is better than the black hat is because with the black hat, um, you would it's like a mandatory to run engineer. Why? Because otherwise, you would barely use your black hat unless you wanted to take out kill streaks, which isn't very practical because the main point of it is to... Uh, and right here, I throw this the thing kind of far. I think that's for about 40 meters, maybe 50. And here's thir about 30, and it blows it up, which is pretty cool because it it hurt at the at the distance. It's hurt you. It hurts you. It also hurts the enemy. Now, I what like what what happens is the closer it is, the uh, the the stronger the signal is to yourself, not to the equipment. Right? Like the equipment, it works at all distances. But if you're really close to the EMP grenade, it'll last like five seconds. But if you're kind of far, as you saw there, I was decently far. It's not going to last long. And I don't know if that was because I threw it or I don't know. I, did, I, I never did this test before. So I can't tell if it was because I threw it and it d affected me less because I'm the thrower. But I don't know, guys. Please leave a like down below because this is better than the black hat. Because with the black hat, you have to run engineer to, and then you have to think, kill the things, and it takes a while too, right? Not on the equipment, but on the kill streaks. And you could easily run the the other thing, the the launcher, the kind of stinger like missile that looks pretty badass in this game. And with that, you can take out things like I think the stealth choppers too, the escort drone. I think it's like if you're close enough, it's one. But uh. Guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please spread it around, share it, or like it at least um, so someone else can see it. Please remember to subscribe if you haven't already. I'm Predator Through It One. Have a nice day, ladies and gentlemen.